traditional Catholic resisted the French Revolution brilliantly for 10 months in 1793 in the region of Vendée, France. They did it in defense of their religious freedom. They did it to protect their priests. They did it to refuse to go on a forced conscription and also to protect their families. They did it against a atheistic governments that started the revolution in Paris. In that time, 80% of the bishop and of the priests were on their side and refused to swear allegiance to the state. Hi, this is Daniel Raborden. You may remember me as a host on EWTN and I am now an independent and I'm creating a movie on the Vendée Rebellion against the French Revolution. After 10 months, the French Republic brought back from Germany some hardened army. Historians are nowadays talking about the genocide, the first genocide of modern history. A genocide committed not by a religious group, not by a racial group, but by an atheist government. It is estimated that at least 140,000 people disappeared, 80% of them being civilians, women, children and older people. These 140,000 brothers and sisters of Vendée did not die in vain. They were martyrs. They were the seeds of missionaries for the century to come. They are also not to be forgotten by ourselves, because educators and historians, both in France and in America, have worked hard to hush that story. So when we are intrigued about the fact that radical liberal ideology are so intolerant, actually, and so brutal. We have to look no further for an explanation but the French Revolution, because those ideologies take the French Revolution as their model. And that revolution was the author of the first genocide of modern history. This is not only a movie, this is beautiful fact related by a very professional team that has been assembled just for that movie. This is also your movie. You shall see on our beautiful website that you can support us. So do not hesitate. For once your value will be brought up to theaters. This is the time. This is our time. Let's take it.